Welcome to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. I'm TNT Dine. I'm IT Explosive One. Let's crack into another one. Heck yeah, TNT. Yo. I, uh, I'm considering getting some sleevage of tattoos. Okay, we just did branding the other day, and now you're talking about getting sleeves, huh? I was, I've been thinking about it. To go from completely bare arms to having sleeves is that's. A I don't, but I don't think I would do the. I think I'm. I think I would do from the knee down, knee to the ankle. Those aren't sleeves. Those that, are. Those are leg sleeves. Are we calling those sleeves? They're still sleeves. Yeah. If you get what it do you call? Okay, so wait, hold on, hold on. We got to get into this. Okay, so on a shirt, we call those sleeves because you put your arms through them. Okay. When you put on pants. What do you call those holes that you put your pa- your your legs into in the plants? The legs. We, we don't call I'm them legs. Sleeves. <laughs> I'm gonna get some leg legs. I'm gonna get some pants sleeves. I uh, I've thought about it, right? Like I've been thinking about it. Capri I, well, sleeves. actually, like okay, so I have to. I already have tattoos on my back, and I've thought about like I always kind of wanted like a back piece. Yeah. But you know, and I can, I can, I can still do that. Mm-hmm. Um, cause I have like some foundational stuff that I could either like go over, work with, but I was thinking about doing something like with my legs. Cause I don't really want like arm sleeves. I don't think because, and here's the reason I don't know what I would, I don't know what I want. Okay. And like, if it's on your arms, you have to look at it all the time. Yeah. And yeah. if it's on your legs, like you still got to look at it. Right. But like you can cover it up with pants. I mean, yeah, you can cover up your arm sleeves with like a long. I don't sleeve like shirt. wearing long sleeves. I don't like wearing long pants either. Long Let me sleeve ask you this. pants. If you were gonna get a sleeve, what would you? What like what kind of stuff would you put in a sleeve? I've, you know what, honestly, Jones, I've thought about this for a while. I have one tattoo, and it is on my arm, and it is a, uh, it's a Gears of War tattoo. Um, and I was thinking that I would like to do sleeves of all of some of the, uh, the greatest video game yeah. characters, media content that I've, I, cause I'm an addict and I'll hundred percent attest to it. I'm hundred percent a video game addict. I love it. There are certain characters that have like impacted my life through these games and there's certain stories that I will never forget. So I would like to get something for overwatch. I'd like to get something for mass effect. I, when I was playing mass effect back in the day, when it was new, I always thought about getting like an N seven across my chest oh, like I, right I don't there know where what that key- means but it's, i imagine it's part of the game it's the normandy just the name of the ship but you know it's just like we got into a nerdy conversation because you asked me what tattoo i would get no no it's fine i've actually thought for my leg sleeves i've thought about doing do? uh old school nintendo characters like okay. the guy from contra mario kart kart like a mario maybe okay. you know just things like that because yeah. those were the kind of games that like i grew up with that I, and it would be like colorful because like all my tattoos are black like, I have very much tribalish black tattoos on my back and stuff. Like, so if I got, like, a leg one, I would want something that kind of stood out, was very, like, brilliant. But then, like, the other leg, I probably would do more in, like, dark colors or something. Like, yeah. so, like, I don't know. But I thought about doing, like, stuff, like, not so much video game, all video games like that, but more of, like, 8-bit, like, stuff or it's something. The, I don't know. Very, very nostalgic, very boomer a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I thought just... about also getting, like, a whole leg sleeve of like things that I had like in my life. Okay, give me some examples. Like I would maybe get like a microphone because we podcast and like that's a part of my life. Maybe a volleyball. Fair. Maybe a uh, like some sort of thing to imp- to represent improv or act act like the acting or comedy or something. Comedy tragedy face. Yeah, some, I don't know. I would have to think about what it would be, but I, maybe like it would just be a collage of things that like in my life. You know, get a crack pipe because I used to be a crack addict. You I know? remember those yeah, years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a light bulb. I just get a, a drilled out light bulb on there. You really loved crack. I did. It was. It so was crazy. Good. It was but, absolutely. Uh, nuts. I don't know, dude. You know, I'm a sneakerhead, so maybe get a pair of Jordans. You not are really. not I'm a sneakerhead. I'm not a sneakerhead. <laughs> I'll get some Airwalks tattooed on me. Do you even me. own a pair of Nikes? Ooh. Wow. Now I don't. Wow. I used to. I used to own a pair of Nikes. I used to, I used to get Nikes. Uh, no crap. Everybody's owned a pair of Nikes. Now, I, I curr- was asking now. I currently you. do not. Because the main... Sh- like, I have some I have some Under Armour shoes. You got some right Vans, now. don't you? No. You don't own Vans? No, I got some Under Armour shoes. Well, because the, the issue I have is Skechers. like... Skechers. Strike me as a uh, Skechers guy. No. I, I mean, I've had Skechers in the past. It's the ass. What do I have? What I I don't I don't know. New what balances. Brand. Yeah, I definitely have oh, some new balances. Oh no, Jonas! You can't be wearing new balances. Not I don't wear them around. They're, those, I mean, they're, I've had them in the last a few years ago or something. Those are sensible shoes. What does that mean? You can't be wearing sensible shoes. I'm a sensible kind of guy. <laughs> <laughs> Jonas is going to get a collage with like a seatbelt and a helmet. 
<laughs> so I enjoy I, safety. My 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 fucking uh, sleeve's gonna say, "What are those?" <laughs> I mean, it might as well. But yeah, I don't know what. Like, I I would like to do it. I just don't know what to get. Yeah. And uh, well, the problem too I have like more on my arms than on my leg is like when I like I've I've gained and lost a lot of weight. So like when your skin's not super firm, it's really hard to tattoo, mm -hmm. and they have to like hold it in like almost to the point where like you get bruised because they have to hold your skin so taut. Yeah. And like so that wouldn't be ideal probably either. Like, yeah, it'd be like. That'd be uncomfortable. It well, would be uncomfortable. Yeah, but, but getting like, tattooed is pretty uncomfortable. Yeah, I like anyway. it. Yeah, I've thought about getting it on my leg. I don't know what I would get. Like that's. I mean, I'm 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 still throwing the idea around. I'm, I'm surprised. I've never known you to even like. I said you you don't really have like any tattoos on your appendages. Yeah, mine are all hidden. Yeah, yeah. But the whole point is so like. Well, because here's the thing. I love tattoos. I got a bunch when I was younger. Um, cause I did want to get like a back piece, like eventually work on getting a back piece together, which yeah. I might just still work on that and, and do some editing to the tattoos I have. But like back then, but don't you have like the whole, like, you know, like the whole, like, you know, you got like the whole Yeti issue going on there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that, that's fine. Yeah, <laughs> am I allowed to say yeah, that? Yeah, is that all right? Like, yeah, I've got I don't, I don't I'm a man. I, you know. All right, yeah, Jonas they, is a hairy shave, ass motherfucker. They, they shave it off when they tie it. You. You're gonna make some poor sap. No, I mean, I I usually trim that shit down anyway. I don't know how you get back there. It's it's very well. You put okay, a weed I whacker can, on a stick. I and can just... do it myself, and I have. It takes a long time. It's fucking a pain in the ass. Usually, I have someone else do it for me. I'm not changing. I'm never going to ask you to do it. I'm okay. I usually, mean, I'm not. Usually it is a lady friend in my life that yeah. will take care of that. And it, and and I don't have them shave it all the way down. Just use like buzzers and just trim it. And and it yeah, and it, and and I've never had uh every uh every woman that I've ever asked to do it has been more than happy to do it. Really? I mean, because yeah, I guess because it's just dealing with like a man issue. It's endearing women like doing stuff. Well, like right, that. And, and like I've, and they're I've like just never. Oh and, my god! And, and it, what's interesting about you saying this is like, I've always been like, yeah, it's kind of weird, right? I would never Not ask really. one of my bros to do it ever. Yeah. Like, I never be like, hey, dude, can you help me out? Real? No, like no. I'll do it myself. Um. But, like, every woman that I've been like, hey, can you help me out with this? And they all are like, oh, I could imagine. That's a giant pain in the ass. Sure. I'd and it takes, like, two minutes. Yeah. It doesn't take long at all when someone else is doing it. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it's not really that weird of a situation. A ton of people have it. I could not imagine because I'm smooth as a baby's ass. And, like... It sucks ass, especially living in Texas in the summer. Yeah. It's like, it's like having... In, like, I'm always know. hot. And that's probably why. I wouldn't know. Yeah. Yeah, dude. That's why. Yeah, it sucks. But no, like I've done that huh. before. I've, I, but I've went all my tattoos that are on my back. Um, when I went and got them when I was younger, I didn't do that. And it wasn't as bad because I was younger. But I was um, thinking like uh, because of the amount of hair that you that you can have on your back, like would it be worth getting a back tattoo if nobody's going to see it? For, for I mean, full I don't glory? walk around with my shirt off ever, really, unless I get in the pool. It's yeah. more for me, but like. But yeah, but it's on your back, so you never get to see it. I, yeah, I forget I have them all the time. Yeah, absolutely. So I don't know, man. I don't know what I want to do, but I want to get some more tattoos. I think I uh, I need to feel alive, and that'll help do it. You should get uh, a tattoo that says "sweet," and I should get a tattoo that says "dude." Oh, just like the movie. What does mine say? Sweet, <laughs> dude. What does mine say? Yeah, like I don't well, know, but I don't know what I would get, and I would need like I do have some friends that tattoo though, so like I might be able to be like, hey, if I do. kick you like five hundred bucks, well, you, what will that get me? And they might five hundred bucks is gonna get you something. Decent. Well, tattoos are really expensive anymore, but. If it's a friend and I'm like, hey, I'll just kick you like 500 bucks. How much work will you do? That's they might be more willing piece. to like be like, oh, well, I'll touch up what you have and da 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 da, whatever. Because I would, if I was gonna do stuff on the back, I probably would get everything I have that I'm not gonna like cover up with something else touched up first because it's all old, mm -hmm. and then I would go from there and fill in all the rest and do stuff. So I don't know, man. We'll see. I've been, I've been, I've been, uh, I've been thinking about it a lot lately. So. Who knows? Next thing you know, I might have the Tyson, dude. I might get the, the face tat. That is something you should do. I 100% am for you getting a face tattoo. We need to normalize them. Yeah, Face no, no. tattoos are there's okay. A lot, hey, there's a lot of things in this world that I will help normalize. Face tats are not one of them. Why not? You could be the, the difference maker. I saw, dude, I saw, okay, real quick and I'll go. <laughs> I saw a picture of this chick online who, who like, it posted something and she was like, she was like, 
the day I got my face tat on my 30th, still my favorite tattoo. And it's just like a little heart under her eye. Yeah. And I'm like, that shit looks trashy as F. Uh, she goes, in the little comment, she's like, people still ask me if it's real. Ha, ha, ha. And I'm like, because it looks like ass. You only say you're proud of it because you don't, you regret the shit out of it and don't want to look like a fool. No, you have to project power, Jones. You have to pro project uh, confidence. I can't, dude, I just can't believe. I, just, I don't know, dude. Like getting a little heart under your eye, like. I'm Bruh. good, yeah. I'm, I'm going to get a J right under him. That's <laughs> such a good idea. Do it. <laughs> right here. Or no, I'll just get like a little booger tattooed on my upper lip. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I Anyways, go to thecrazytown.com for Jonas. TNT. We out.